Number 1. Nail Salon Unknown lady flips out on nail salon workers when she does not want to pay for a horrible job they did on her nails. The nail salon workers fight back. You got to love the language barrier. You can to get out, okay? You can. You have a seat, Blake. You have no. a seat. You like that seat. Don't, don't touch me. Don't talk anymore, okay? Touch me. Why are you going to come here? Do not touch me. Okay. Do not touch me. Do not touch me. Let me out of here. This is horrible. And she did a horrible job, but she won't fix that. She's very happy, and then she looked at the whole color. She not happy the color. And then she said, I do a very back job, everything. And then she was I will run 50%, but I have to go get these redone. And then she's very you loud and then she went, she, hit, hit, she hit me and then she said, I, I did not hit you. You hit me. Said, I have a yeah, you hit me, okay? Yeah, because you won't let me out of here. Shut up. You shut up. You shut up. You shut up. You shut up. Don't talk anymore, okay? You she shut up. You, you shut up. You shut up. Don't hit me, okay? You shut up. You shut up. What are you doing? You shut up. No. Yeah. Say why? Shut up. You yeah. shut up. Very nice nail. No, no, it's horrible. But if you don't want to pay, and if you say it like that, okay? No, I said I'll pay you fifty percent. No, unless you want to fix it. They're no. all different yeah. lanes. Don't say that. You liar. You don't touch me. Don't touch me. Touch me. Do not touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. I will break. You let her out. I am. The cops are on their way, Ashley. Yeah. The police are on their way. If she doesn't be let out right now, they're going to come. I'll be able to break the door down. We're going to charge you. Um, she was getting her nails done, apparently, and they, she didn't want to pay for them because they did a bad job. And uh, now they just locked the door, and they were holding her down, and they were physically assaulting her that I saw. And my, I got a friend here with me, and he's videotaping the whole thing. Number two, need manager's name. Unknown man refuses to leave until he gets the manager's name. I guess he never heard of Google.com. Is she salaried or is she hourly? I mean, that is none of your business. I, well, the simple fact is, a manager is a manager. It is so, a manager, and like, I mean, she, uh, it's we'll, you, we'll it's address this a different manager. way. This is a property management company that's headquartered somewhere else. And I'm the right? assistant manager, and you're more than welcome to sit here and talk to me. And I mean, as soon as my property manager is back on site, she is going to be more than willing to give you. Right. So, uh, the, the Evergreen Real Estate is a larger company that's headquartered somewhere else, correct? In Nashville. Fantastic. Let me get that number. Okay. It's on their website. I couldn't care less, sir. Thank you for your input. Number three. This worker is told his coffee sucks. And the customer wants his money back. No coffee and donuts for you. Tell me that you're not going to stir it or give me a new one. Well, how do I know what it try? Well, how do I know what it tastes like? So if you mess my coffee up, I can't try it. Is that funny, Nate? Can you make me a new coffee or can you my money back, Nate? Nate, please. I'll video. I got I got the right to video whatever I want. If I can record a cop, I can record a Dunkin' Donuts worker. Now make me a new one, get my money back. Tough guy. Oh, you are being tough. You're laughing at me and saying that I can't try my coffee to see if it tastes like. It's made wrong. I want a new coffee. I want my money back. Give me a full refund now. Give me a full refund now. Chump telling me you ain't giving me shit back until I pulled the camera out. You just said you ain't getting nothing back. Until I pulled my camera back, you told me I'm not getting nothing. No, I told you to get your money back. No, you said I'm not giving you a new one. That's what you ordered. That's what you told me. I'm sticking to that. I'm getting your money back. You're not going to You said you're not getting your money back until I said pull the camera out. Until I pulled the camera out, you said I'm not getting nothing back. You started acting like a tough guy until I pulled my camera off. Number 4. Direct TV lady call customer the B word. Don't mess with Walmart customers. They are not playing that. Call me rude. Yeah, I did. Man, I'm sorry. Call me rude. 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 Call me Stereotyping. Stereotyping? You yeah. f***ing called me rude All when I, did, I walked by. Because you didn't rep- Because you're f***ing annoying. No, I'm not. I was busy I, I doing something and you interrupted me. Okay, ma'am. You're the rude f- 
Okay, ma'am. Well, let me be the rude bitch. Number 5, lady disputes charges on her card, says she is telling the CEO, so they better watch out. Okay. Here you go. On camera. Um, we are not taking a picture. Yeah, I already already got you on camera, and in fact, That's it's nice. videotaped. I need you're you nice. to leave my store right now. Okay. Well, you're on camera, all okay. of you. Okay. Okay. Bye. Well, it's going to the CEO tomorrow. Okay. And I'm not kidding, because I'm not a kid. I'm not 20 Ooh. years old. I'm 48, okay. and that is legal. I don't okay. want to be threatened, ma'am. I'm Well, I'm sorry, orders. but no, you're not taking orders. You're making your own policy. Because no manager would do that. Okay, can you please leave? I don't even know Ray Gonzalez. I gave you his number. You okay, and him. and after that, I'm reporting you to the credit card company, and I'm going to end the Better Business Bureau. And your name is going along with Amanda on those okay. documents. And then when the CEO finds out, all of you are going to be fired. Okay. Have a nice day. You too. Have a nice day. There you are. You're on video. And I'm sending it too. Because you know what? I'm computer literate. Okay. Yeah. Number Super 6. Man demands to see the manager because he was born in this country. That was an embarrassing situation and you made me sell it out. You're rude. Oh, she heard me. Everyone heard me. All oh, everyone hears me. Don't use the Lord given thing. That's a hate crime. Don't say God in my presence. Because you have no God. Can I speak to the manager, please? Can I speak to the manager, please? I'm having a question right here. Yeah, I'm going to talk to the manager. Okay, then you come to me. Can you sit down? I'm going to call the manager after I start Yeah, yeah. Okay. You asked me a question, I responded, and then you told me I can't come back. No. Honey, you've been in this country about five years. I was born here. Well, that is it for now. If you like this video, please subscribe and hit that like button. If you feel the need, we would love to hear from you. So please leave a comment below on how we did or didn't do. Super 6 out.